I'm Joe from Blue Hub, and today I'm going to be taking you through the um, stock receiving process on the WMS app. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to come up to the top left hand corner and hit this purchase tab. We're going to go ahead and create a simple purchase. We're going to enter in our supplier details. For this, I'm just going to use the Blue Hub customer and we're going to select our location. Then we can scroll down and we can add a couple of items to our order. I'm just going to add a CPU with a quantity of 10, a price of 150. I'm going to add one more and I'm going to add a GPU uh, with a quantity of 15, at a price of 200. Now I'm happy with this order, I'm going to go ahead and authorize. Now what we can do is we can head over to the WMS app. We want to note the um, purchase order number here, so 318. We're going to open up our WMS app. We're going to go to receive. We're going to go to with PO, and then we can type in here 318, and our order should pop up. We can select the order. We can hit finish. This will show us the products that we need to receive in. And so we can go ahead and click into one of these, enter in the SKU. You are also able to scan the, the SKU if you have a barcode for it. What you can do is you can select the quantity and then you can receive partially, or on the left hand side, you can receive all. I'm gonna do the same for the GPU. And I'm gonna go ahead and receive all of these as well. What we can do now is we can go ahead and hit save and say that this um, order has been stock received. This is authorizing the stock received stage of this purchase order. What we can go ahead and do now is if we go back to the main menu and we go to put away, it will show us the products that we need to put away. So we can select into here. We can put our bin in and then we can also put in our um, SKU for this as well. So once we hit enter, it will give us the same option to enter a quantity and place partially, or we can go ahead and place all. I'm going to do that one more time for the SKU. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pop it into a different bin. So once we hit enter, it will show us where we're going to enter into the quantity. We can place partially if we want to enter a certain quantity to place partially, or we can go ahead and place all. Once we are happy with that, we can go ahead and hit finish. Then we can see that this has been uh, completed in the purchase order on the web app. It does convert it to an advanced order, um, but then you'd go ahead and complete that from there. So we can come into the stock received and now we can see that both of these stages have been authorized and uh, completed. So what we can do now to finish the order is go into the invoice. We can add a invoice number. I'm just going to add a random one. We can add an invoice date. We can copy from receiving. And once we are happy with it, we can go ahead and authorize. That is the stock receiving process and the put away process for the WMS app. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.